Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and welcome back to Blue Plays Elden Ring. Uh, literally three seconds have passed since I hit stop on that last recording, because I just want to get right back into a brand new area. Super excited. Here are my stats. Uh, I am using the Carrying Greatsword, Greater Oracular Bubble, Gravity Well, and the Small Oracle Bubbles. And uh, I also have Roderick's, <laughs> Godric's Great Rune with a Rune Arc, hence my stats being so ridiculously high right now for the level that I am. Uh, but, where do we want to head? Do we want to head right to the castle? I'm thinking... No? Now, what's over here at the fire? Is it a... Oh, hey, Sight of Grace. Excellent. And a merchant. Even better. So, let's grab this. And then we're going to backtrack, I think, that way. Before we head into this castle. Oh, I'm hoping for more cookbooks. I am not selling. All right, short and sweet to the point. Any runes? I do have several runes, actually. Oh, that's right, because I went to the graveyard. So we'll just sell all of those and see what you have. Okay, kukri. Hey, kukris. I like kukris. I do have 6,800. Another crack pot. Always going to buy my crack pots. 2,000 rune stored, uh, stone sword key. Ooh, bastard sword. Excellent. Light crossbow. Eh, not a big crossbow fan. Red Thorn, Round Shield, Round Shield, Iron Set, which is pretty cool, actually. Uh, Crimson Amber Medallion. Now, this is one of the starting keepsakes. So, I did some testing. I think it's about 6% added HP. Eh. And then Demi Human Mobs. Okay, might as well. Let's grab that Talisman, just because that way we have it. You will. Really, uh, man, a few words. So let's go to the notes here. I need the demi-human mobs. Ah, slay the demi-human mobs leader first and the rest will lose hope and panic. Actually, that's pretty cool. Not something that I have actually noticed myself. All right. Oh, Sight of Grace is actually heading further that way. Um, Oh, before, before we actually go and explore, let's go grab the map. Which is very close. I probably didn't need a beacon. I dare say I definitely didn't need a beacon. Uh, unless something's going to be waiting for me right inside this wall. Maybe this isn't the castle. Oh, no. There's the castle. <laughs> These are just some of the outer fortifications. Which makes total sense. Alright. I love, by the way, when you reach your beacon, it automatically goes... No, 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 no. Okay. Grab that. Grab that. That's an... That's a giant archer. Weeping Peninsula. Gross, first and foremost. Actually, might be one of those. Ooh, okay. Might be one of those uh, sentinels. Okay. Oh, I'm technically in combat. I'm not really in combat game. Come on. All right, well, let's, let's back up. Nope, those are trees. Let's back up. Let's head to where I wanted to go, which is I'm going to take that spirit spring up, I think. As I'm looking the wrong direction or the, a different direction. Yeah, let's just take that up. And can I look at my map now? Nope, still not. Oh, hey. That's a cool looking building. That's a very cool looking building. Quick question back. Can I use my map? I still can't. He's still shooting at me. What a jerk. What a jerk. Ooh, I like this. Ooh, I see a lectern. Oh, these are uh, not friendlies. Oh, you have glowing eyes, though. Let's go ahead and take care of you. Oh, you didn't die. You didn't die. Oh, that just reaches so far. Excellent. You're gone. Uh, oh, it's the door seems to be sealed. And there's a lectern out here. It's an imp statue. Seek three wise beasts. Seek three wise beasts. Oridus's rise. Oh, no. Oh, is this... This is a wise beast, isn't it? You put it here to teach me that. Is that a wise beast? Does it say to seek two? No, it just. Mm, 
Okay, well, if I see spirit turtles, I think I sadly know what I need to do. Is that another lost sight of grace already? It sure is. Oh, what is happening here? Some sort of ritual? Well, this is exciting. It's all exciting. Oh my gosh, I love just coming on new areas. So, of course, Litany of Proper Death would probably be pretty cool here, huh? All right, let's summon. Nope, 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 that's a telescope. <laughs> it's it's actually impressive. How terrible, what is that? Okay, quickly, quickly, quickly. Yeah, and I think I will get on horseback while you just uh, handle it. Okay, here we go. All right. Oh, you summoned a big guy. Oh, sorry, Torrent. Nice. Look at what, ow, uh, what you can do though. Wow, my follower is awesome. Oh, no, no, no. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Wow, wombo combo, okay. Oh, the rune arc, I gotta be more careful. I gotta use my bubbles more, all right. Really, Steak America, there was a it's a lost sight right there. Okay. Let's uh let's do this a little bit better. Okay. Oh, wow, already out of magic. Okay, decent damage. Yeah, really decent damage, actually. Oh, what is this? Is like a crater site? Whoa. Okay, switch targets, switch targets. Nice. Nope, oh, just out of range. There's the combo, though. Excellent. Uh, oh, there's actually stuff in there. Can I investigate it? No? Definitely looks like that's a material I should be able to harvest. Gra gravity stone chunk. Crafting material? I didn't pay attention. No? Is it actually something I can use? It is. Okay, gravitational explosion. I do love the idea of gravity being a magical item. Um, hmm, okay. That was a cool little ritual they were doing here, and they summoned forth that horrific guy. Ah, uh, you know what I should do is, did I ever make any Rawa Raisins, Roa Raisins? No, let's not make 97, but let's make, let's make some, and let's put that, uh, let's actually replace it. One of these days I'm gonna get that. Let's actually replace the telescope with the raisins. Oh, look, we got a sweet raisin. So then we can just feed, feed again. There we go, all right. Okay, so here's that big graveyard I wanted to check out. These giant tombs, should we go above it though? Yeah, let's go above and scope it. Anything on top of the ruins there? Usually it's just ruined fragments. Oh, now we're too high though. Yeah, I'm not gonna survive that. Oh, but there's an item. Guy sitting in a chair. Hey, Stone Sword Key. I have so many of those. So many. Oh, hey! It's one of these things that leads me to catacombs. Guide and gate key. Uh. Okay. So, what I'm thinking that. Oh, hey, this is uh, pretty big, actually. This is huge! I think that maybe that is in that graveyard because it's obviously pointing down into the ground. So it's either accessed in the wall there, which I don't think it is, or it's from this big graveyard. And we're gonna, we're gonna go with that. I'm gonna go under that assumption. At least, you know, that's where I wanted to head anyway. 
Okay, it looks like giant dragonfly in the back of that one. I mean, there should be a cave here. Oh. All right, we got a catacomb. You look like a different color dragonfly. Everything, everything all right? Okay. Impaler's catacomb. That sounds lovely. That sounds not like I'm about to be, you know, impaled or anything. Okay. Let's get the shield up while we explore. Oh, you. Oh, okay. Can't use my, uh, my bubbles. Okay, Rape, you're doing just fine. All right. Definitely be on the lookout for illusory walls, for places to drop down. Uh, all right, lantern time, right? Right, okay. Might as well activate the summoning pool. I finally did my first round of co-op last night on PC. That was a ton of fun. Hopefully, we can definitely do some more of that. Okay. Of course, I am going to take that hit. Oh, and it made me miss. Take that. Uh, hopefully, I'm not surrounded. Nope. Uh, tell you what. How about... Oh, gosh. That works out nicely. Thank you uh, for catch it again. So many of those. Okay, what level? What level? One. Eh, fine. <laughs> Definitely going straight here. Nothing up on the walls. Oh. You just played your card way too early. You know, the range on the rapier makes it a perfect candidate for... Oh, you know what? I am going to at least get rid of my faith. I don't need that if I'm not using incantations. That's an absolute waste. Let's do... HP? No, let's actually do FP. So I can use magic more if needed. Is that really it? Level two. No. All right. But Marika's seal is, is that still worth it? I don't even know if that's still worth it actually. Because it's intelligence, faith and arcane. I really only want it for the intelligence. So I'm, you know what? I don't think I do want that. Oh. By the way, I don't think I ever read this. Prince of Death's Pustule. I probably need to go and talk to uh, Rajay about this. A fed pustule taken from facial flesh raises vitality. It is said that this pustule came from the visage of the Prince of Death, he who used to be called Godwin. So was that face down there Godwin somehow? As first dead of the demigods, it said he's buried deep under the capital at the Earth Tree's... I think that's... I think that might be him. I think that actually might be Godwin down there in the basement below Stormvale. Um, I'm just trying to think of what else I want to do. Could you guard counters? Or do I just... Let's go with the standby. If we're going to be doing some more guard counters with the rapier. Oh, yeah. This is... Oh. Right. Where am I supposed to escape, though? Oh. Okay. I don't see... Oh. Okay. You just have to rush for that. That's kind of devious. Because that goes kind of quick. Okay. Where's the next... Huh? Is that an... Al All right. Maybe that's an illusory wall over there. It's not. So. Where 
where do you go? Uh. Huh? Alright, hold on. Let's reassess. Oh, I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. Oh. It, oh, it does go all the way. It does go all the way, but that... How is that not an instant kill? That's weird. I mean, I should be complaining, but I'm kind of complaining, because... That's kind of weak. Uh... It causes blood buildup, but too slow to do anything. Oh, quick. All right, but wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Now I just feel like I'm stuck here, though. Because I can't actually make it out. Something's... Something doesn't feel right here. Okay. Torch. Always look for the light source. Darn it. <laughs> How about there? What? The fact that that light source is off center tells me something something about it. What a weird puzzle. Do I have any of those light arrows actually? Or can I make them? What are they? The rainbow arrows? Oh, I don't have any bones. Now it's not the rainbow stone chart. There's actually a glow. Maybe I never bought it. Oh man. See, I have glow stone. Truly at a bit of a loss here. Okay. I'm gonna use a couple of fire arrows. Just to, I mean, there's a torch there. Nope. Oh, this is, this is confusing me. I can't, I can't get out. I can't fast travel. But there's nothing here. All right. Okay, I can escape that way. Oh. Hold on. Am I supposed to actually drop down? I don't know why I put my memory of grace there. Let's see. Um, do I want the warming stone? Do I not have any? There we go. I want the... No. That's not what I want, though. Can I craft any? I want the items that tell you if you can drop. Item crafting. I don't want script stone. What is it called? <laughs> it's been so long. Not glowstone. I know that I can make these, right? Am I being crazy right now? Huh. I'm not, I'm not sure. I'm not seeing them. Hmm. Well, that is disappointing, but. Okay, that's not far. That's not far. All right. Well, that's, that's me being silly. Spending way too much time on this quote unquote puzzle. Aha, okay. That's great. Violet, definitely get my shield back out. I thought for sure there's going to be an illusory wall. And now we're up to skeletons. I don't have anything to do a great job of killing them. Although, I guess they're not quite skeletons as much as they are just zombies, so that's okay. They're very slow. 
Oh, they grab. That's right. I would actually like them to fall down. Oh. But you know what? If I can get a backstab, that'll count too. Excellent. Oh, no, 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 no. Mash, mash, mash. Oh, okay, that mashing worked. So that is great. Backstab for a little bit more health and FP back. Hey, please help. A new, new prattling stone. Cool. You guys aren't just endless, are you? No, I don't want that. You know what's interesting? There's actually seemingly... Yeah, I think they might be endless. I think there's actually a direct hit uh, point for the Carrying Greatsword. So if you're actually not exactly where you'd want to be with the blade, then, uh, yeah, you take less damage. Oh, hello. Back up, back up, back up. Beautiful. And these just look like illusory walls. Okay, not, not gonna actually worry about all these zombies. Nope, nope, nope. Let's just go. Unless there's, you know, walls I'm missing. Quite possible. It's nice. I haven't done a catacomb in a while, it feels like. And there's the lever. And is this going to be a little Skyrim door? It's going to bring... Okay. Drop for me. Hey, look, a fork tatchet. And no one was surprised. And look at that, right back at the door. Do we rest? We have to rest. Right? Just a couple of uh, couple of imps in the way. Yeah, let's do it. Let's rest up. No idea what this boss is going to be. Let's not take any chances. Boy, I'm uh, really bummed I can't use my bubbles. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, would you? All right, never mind. <laughs> I'm out of here. We're just running for the boss. And I don't see any gold summons. And what do we have? We have, oh, okay. We have another Earth Tree Burial Watchdog, this time with imps. That's just, I'm not even worried about the watchdog so much. Maybe I ought to be, unless, can you kill? That'd be cool if you could kill your imps, I don't know. Okay, that worked. Uh-oh. Nope. Nope. You know, when they start doing that wild charge, I think you're gonna wanna roll into them. Otherwise, uh... Oh, come on. Nope, this is bad. Oh. Oh, this is really bad. Oh my goodness. Um, could do gravity well? Gravity well is not gonna work. Oh my. No, I just need to. Oh, you're not dead. All right, Flask of Wondrous, let's go. You guys, I, I really don't like the imps. I can just kill him. Oh, no, I can't. What? Did he really just dodge last second? Okay, one more imp. No, 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 no. Okay, 
it's a real bummer that he doesn't hurt them. Okay. I am going to heal up here in a moment. There we go. Do your thing. Slam that sword. You. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm telling you, the imps should be their own boss. I haven't even touched the boss. Or this last imp in a while. Here we go. You got to be kidding me. Just kill him. Okay, now. Curious about gravity well on you. I don't see it working well, but you know, heh, <laughs> well. Nope. Alright. How about carrying great sword though? 200? Oh, wow. That's uh that's a lot, all things considered. Although, if I can get a a combo. It's just not very fast at casting. One more. That's gonna hurt. Yep. Nice. How about a, uh, I would say how about a power shot, but 57. Yeah, let's do a power shot. 110 is not bad. Oh, please don't die. I don't want to do this fight again. I'm acting like, oh, wrong. Yeah, I'm uh, acting like I can't lose this fight and I clearly very, very much can. Okay, all we need to do, dodge three of these. One more. And then just combo. <clears throat> just combo. I'm still scared I'm gonna die to him. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Sloppiest fight I think I've had yet. Demi-human ashes, okay. Ashes are always fun. Also, I could have summoned my ancestral spirit that whole time. Totally forgot, totally forgot. Grab some root resin. And yeah, all right, catacombs, uh, catacombs done. Phew. <laughs> I would have been really upset if I died right there at the end. I need more crowd control. You know what? Glintstone Arc, I gotta get it back. I know it's easy mode, but man, maybe I need easy mode. In fact, I'm almost certain that I do. All right, anything else over here worth checking out? Little Trina's Lily. By the way, I was told, uh, I apparently, oh wow, I am hurting. Apparently I missed the book in order to get uh, Trina's Lily crafting. It was a vendor in Liurnia. I even looked at the book and then didn't buy it either. I, I don't know if I didn't have enough runes at the at the time. But yeah, uh, I could have had sleeping arrows, which is definitely what I want to do. Now we only have about a minute left. I have no health left. I am curious to see if I can find these three, what are they called? Y spirits? Oh, there's one of those little I don't know what you want to call it. I always feel like it has to do with astrology. Whether or not that's true, I'm not sure. But uh, normally they have the little spirit chart or starlight charts, that's what it is, which is good for FP regeneration. So let's just take a quick ride before we wrap up today to see if there's any more, well, I say any more, I'm assuming that the ghost turtle was one of the wise spirits. Because there was one right behind it. I don't know if you can actually see them from a distance or if it's something that you have to kind of come across them, like get close to them and then they, they appear. I'm 
I'm just so afraid of even the smallest drop killing me. I also don't know what the range would be. Also, why am I running around without any health instead of just resting at a uh, site of grace? I don't know. These are all really good questions. Couldn't tell you. I'm not seeing anything else. But at least I'm back at a site of grace. Hmm. Okay. Let's rest. We're not going to end just yet. Not just yet. I want to just ride around real quick, just avoiding enemies and just see... Can I level up yet? Not even close. <laughs> I just want to see if I can find anything else. We'll spend another... Another minute or two. We're not going to go super, super far. Maybe just do like a loop around this building. See if I can get into that watchtower. Are these wise spirits? <laughs> he answered for me. No. <laughs> I'm dumb. <laughs> um, afraid of the sentinel shooting at me. Also afraid that there's nothing up there when there should be. I see a golden seed. How many of those do I have? By the way, once again, wrong item. I have two, which means if I go grab that golden seed, that's another flask. That is another flask. Now, question is, where was it? How far away... I mean, am I crazy? Didn't I just see one? Uh-huh. Whoa. Sorry, Torrent. What? What in the world? I swear I just saw one. There's definitely something glowing up by the giant or the sentinel. Oh, here's some more of those tarnished sunflowers. What? What was I looking at? Oh, right there. Okay, there is one. Oh, torrent. Okay, let's grab. Please. Okay, go, 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 go. I'm just going to jump every time I hear it. Because I can't fast travel. He said while riding away on a really, really oh, a fast spectral horse. Alright, now I think it's wrapping up time. Let's get back to that spot. Didn't find any... Any of those spirits. But we're going to have to uh, try that out next time. Alright, well, Catacombs down. We have a bit of a mystery with a uh, cool little, what, Oridis, uh, Oridesis, Oridesis tower right up there. That sounds like a cool mystery to figure out, assuming I have to go kill phantom turtles. And, um, yeah, in between episodes, I will work on <laughs> figuring out my build a little bit better, just namely the talisman, since I don't really want to use any more rune arcs because I keep dying and losing them. But that's going to do it for this episode of Blue Plays Elder Ring. I hope you're enjoying it, and I hope you're playing, not necessarily along, because I really hope you're doing tad bit better than I am. But thanks so much for watching and I will see you next time.